The Cubs have taken two of the first three from the Marlins this weekend, yet the North Siders are just one game over the 500 mark. Considering the lofty expectations for Sweet Lou and company, May better be a productive month for the Cubbies. And today at Wrigley, Greg Maddox and Ferguson Jenkins had their respective 31s retired. Different eras, but both phenomenal pitchers. Bottom one, some defense right out of the gates. Jeremy Hermida robs Kosuke Fukudome in left. Great play. one nothing Marlins at this point, but Aaron Miles gets that run back in the second. Giovanni Soto doubled. Miles did the same. Soto scores. We are knotted up at one. Two innings later, Mike Fontenot, the little guy, has got a lot of power. His fifth of the year, a solo shot. He was two for four on the day. And Chicago has the 2-1 lead. Derek Lee, second home run of the season on Saturday. Bases loaded in the fifth. And this is a grand slam. The ninth of his career, a 2-2 tie becomes a 6-2 Cubs leave. And the Wrigley faithful, of course, love it. Marlins trying to fight their way back. Down three now. John Baker the opposite way. His second home run of the year. A solo shot. Beck cuts it down to two with six to four. Baker was three for four with three runs. Kevin Gregg, two saves on the year. Looked pretty good today. Got the first two men out. Then a single. Then Emilio Bonifacio robbed by Fuca Dome. And right to end the game in style. 6-4 is the final. Carlos Zambrano gets the win, improves to 3-1, and one, but he left after throwing 78 pitches through five with a strained left hamstring. He is day-to-day. -day. Ricky Nolasco hung with the loss, six innings pitched, eight hits, five earned runs.